here is Veerling. Veerling, a searing line drive to left field, all the way to the wall it goes, and Matt Veerling has the first RBI of the series. It's a double, and the Tigers hop on the White Sox immediately. This is exactly what we talked about in the open. There will be opportunities to jump on the job and gets Young over to third. In the air, left field side, falling quickly and down. It's a base hit, it's an RBI. Dingler. Drives in Young and rookie right fielder lines out and that brings up Lenin Sosa and there's a line drive toward the corner and right it's a base hit Sheets comes around he'll score lead a third it's an RBI single for Lenin Sosa Wait. Here's a chance for Corey Lee to tie this ball game 2-1 Tigers first and third for the White Sox That one crushed to left field and Corey Lee DeVille delivers again Coming in to score is Benintendi. Vaughn will stop at third, and we got a tied ball game here in the fourth, thanks to White Sox. One out, seventh inning in a 2-2 game. Matt Veerling at the plate. On the ground. That's through. It's a base hit. Matt Veerling doesn't wait for the lefties to come up. He hands the Tigers a 3-2 lead. And he gets that fastball out over the plate and just goes right with it to that. Jammed up seventh inning. That's a rocket into right field. Cole Keith, first pitch greeting. Here comes the throw to the plate. It's not in time. Riley Green had long and a 4 2. Zach McKinstry. Left side, base hit and through. Here comes Meadows. It's 5 to 2. McKinstry delivers in a pinch to the dirt. Two down. Line drive out the middle. Kreidler. What a defensive ninth inning. Three baseballs zapped right at Tigers. It is a four pitch ninth inning and a save for Jason Foley. Wow. Yes, he's playing second base. 2 1. Rip to left field. Ibanez drops it down. Joey Cora says, Come on, Matt Veerling. He'll get there standing. And once again, the Tigers jump on the White Sox. It is one zip. At Started off again here in the third. He doubled and scored against Kai Bush in that first inning. That ball's crushed. Matt Veerling is out of here. Going a home run. Number 15 for Matt Veerling. Tigers take a 2 0 lead in the third. A pair of 3 1 It's the lefty Colt Keith. Slow chopper, first base side. Bush fell off the mound. The flip goes to first, and they get the out. The Tigers pick up a run. You said it early in the first inning. He fell off the mound. That time, he almost became a. Greens at third. That ball is smashed. Gapworthy all the way to the wall. It's 4 0. Jake Rogers, a missile. Baker Meadows, another lefty in this Tigers lineup. That ball's cranked to center field. It was a prelude, that foul ball was, and it is 5 nothing at the plate. Inside out swing, that one gets into right field. White Sox on the board as Baldwin goes first to third. An RBI single for Jokes. I can't remember the last time we saw Tarek Skubal give up three hit the double plays first time off. This time he's going to drive in the second one of the game. It's now a five to two game. Four hits in an inning. Hit hard. Watch out. Almost took off Skubal's head. Corey Jokes the play at the play. And he safe stated for Riley Green. Ground ball first base side. Sheets throws to second high to get the out there. The Tigers pick up run number six. And the first out of the fourth inning is a Riley Green RBI. Runners at the corners, 6-3 Tigers. Spencer Torkelson. Torque rips this ball to left field. That's a base hit and run number seven. Veerling scores it. Jake Rogers. On the ground into center field. Jake Rogers comes through and makes a 9-3 tight lead. And here's the DH, Colt Keith. He charges this ball to center. Robert back at the track, at the wall. He lost his hat and didn't catch the ball. It's gone. Colt Keith, a two-run homer, and the Tigers scratch out double fit on the ninth. Jake ends up on second here with one out. Fly ball, right field. Fletcher's back. He has no shot. Zach McKinstry goes deep. Zach McKinstry with his fourth. Two away. 
that is that. Strike three, Shelby Miller strikes out the side, and the Tigers blow out the White Sox 13 to four. It all started with a Matt Veerling double, eventually leading to 13 runs, 14 hits, and a big hug. And adding third. This one well hit to right center, going back, chasing as the right fielder Carpenter, and it's going to hop over the wall into the stands for a ground rule double as Nicky Lopez will score. Andrew Benintendi gets the scoring started. Sox. I both trained by Joey Gomes. Third the other way is Andrew Vaughn. Will it stay fair? Yes! Benintendi will score back to back doubles for the Sox, and it's now a 2 0 lead here in the first. Andrew continues to Carpenter to cruise into third. And now Colt Keith deposits this ball into right field and gives the Tigers a run. First pitch again. He has become Mr. Outage over the last week. Seven games without a home run for the White Sox lineup. This one well hit off the bat of Whoa. Andrew Vaughn. Going, going, Vaughn! His 15th home run of the season. Cue the fireworks. And the White Sox take a 3 to 1 lead here. In the fourth, base runners and pressure on Jonathan Cannon. 2 1 pitch, Meadows left field side toward the line. It goes, and that's a fair baseball and down. Parker Meadows turns on the Jets. Long strides into third, standing up. Three bases for Meadows. Perfect. And the batter is Jace Young. Looks like the Sox will play for two here and give up that tying run if they can turn a double play. Right field side falling quickly and down. Another two strike hit. And the Tigers have tied the ball game with it looks like. Grabbed a bat. He'll pinch hit for Zach McKinstry. 3 2. Hard hit second base. Sosa juggles. Spins it to second. Gets it out. Safe at first. The Tigers do take. It's up Trey Sweeney. Well, it's a good experience. Yes. In the right center, first left on left hit for Trey Sweeney. Hands the Tigers run number. Ibanez is looking for a little bonus here. And Ibanez lights it up left field side. Right on right thunder. And a 7 3 Tigers lead. Andy Ibanez puts a charge into one. On the ground, it's shortstop. It's Sweeney. It's Keith. And it's the ball game. The Tigers hand the White Sox their 100th loss. And a 9 4 final. The Tigers are one short of 500 suddenly.